What's up guys and welcome back to the Now channel. Today's video is going to be a little different as I talk you through the dive and show you what's going on. Today's video, you join my dad and I on a little mission to our local spots and live the Banawi life as we get some dinner for ourselves. As I jumped in, I didn't even have time to turn on the camera. However, the camera came first in this situation and it's not always the best of ideas because you lose fish like this. It's all from experience, unfortunately. And um, however, this one worked out, got the footage, got the shots, got the fish. So I hope you guys enjoy and stay tuned guys. As this is one of my favorite eating fish, spotted grunter. You have to be quite stealthy with these guys as they can be super skittish and they have really soft skin. Meaning if you don't get a good shot placement, they'll rip off. However, this dive, I slowed myself down, just kept my cool, dropped down below the surface so the swell didn't affect my shot and got in a good shot placement behind the gills. A really good holding shot on these types of fish as it will not pull out and tail off. This is an awesome way to start off the dive. Eventually I caught up to my dad and found a really good gully covered by surf. This is a great spot for my target species, the silver stem bus. I dropped down between the gully walls and set up for an ambush. As you can see, a good sized kalum came in on me. However, this is not my target species. But those two silhouettes cruising through the back definitely were, and I placed a good shot placement just below the pectoral fin, which wasn't my preferred spot. I'd prefer to get a cheek shot or in the pectoral fin. However, they got quite tough skin and uh, don't really pull out too easily. I swam to safety in the open water out the surf zone so I could deal with this fish. This is a great size fish for the dinner table as they are still quite young and have really good meat on them. I was super pumped on this. As you can see, the visibility wasn't so great, so this was the last fish we got on this dive and decided to head in. On the swim back in, we came about this unfortunate sighting of a dead shy shark that had been hooked and wrapped itself up, causing it to strangle itself and die. Unfortunately, this is an example of bycatch. This just goes to show how fragile life is. With spearfishing, we are able to be selective and care for the environment around us. By doing this, it has a less negative effect on the reef and the ecosystems around it. What we catch is what we eat, and whatever we don't eat, we give back. Alright, so we're just going to use a few ingredients today and that will be some garlic salt, flour, a beer and oil. These will be the key ingredients that we'll be using to cook our fish. Alright, so today I shot a spotted grunter as well as a brusher or a white muscle cracker. Um, so we're just going to, I've already filleted the fish, got some nice fillets and I'm going to cut them up into little blocks, just nice bite sized blocks. And then we're going to coat it with some salt and then put it into the pan. Okay, now we're going to salt our fish. Just, on. just do the same thing on the other side. Put some seasoned salt over here. This will just give the fish more flavor. We're going to get our oil. We're going to use quite a bit of oil in our pan. Then we get our flour over here. And we get our beer. Put it there. Get the bowl. And we're just gonna take some flour. Gonna need quite a bit of flour because we've got a lot of fish. You take your beer and add it to your flour. So you want to get it into a yogurt type paste, need more beer, 
So now we're getting the right consistency here. It's looking pretty good. Okay, so now we're gonna take our fish. We'll put it into our batter. Get it all nice and thick like that. And put it into the pan. Now the fish is starting to look golden brown, which is really good. Do you have to Yep, I'm good. Yep. Here's our beer battered muscle cracker and spotted grunter. And we just got some ciders as well. We've got a little bit of a crowd going. And we'll check in just now to see how the fish is. Looks like dad's chowing down on the... Anything fresh is still swimming. Fantastic. There we go. Heard it from the man himself. Please don't forget to hit that like, subscribe and notification bell. We greatly appreciate it. It will also help you to see when my videos are released. And leave a comment if you feel like it. Uh, leave ideas and we'll try our best to fulfill a cool video for you guys. Catch you next time.